Now to achieve the objectives of reforms in the security of the West African sub-region, parliamentarians must come together with a uniform legislation that will address the perennial problem. Now this was the thrust of stakeholders at the opening of a two uh, day international roundtable on parliament, uh, parliamentary, parliamentary security sector governance. Mohammed Rabiu Ali reports that it was organized by Conrad Adena Stiftung in uh, conjunction with NL Nils in Abuja. Is insecurity has no place in West Africa, Nigeria in particular. There is, however, new emerging trends in the security situation. This meeting, among other things, will discuss issues of security sector reforms with a view to securing Africa, considering the indispensable role of parliamentarians. We must have it at the back of our minds that the quest for peace and security in every human society is ordinarily centered on perception that constitutes security. Some of these countries have created acute humanitarian crises, manifested in the loss of civilian lives, the destruction of property and infrastructure. For us in the 10th House of Representatives, the People's House, our legislative agenda seeks to improve accountability in the security sector, such that money budgeted for our security agencies are judiciously used for the purpose it is approved. They believe that the ugly trend requires a comprehensive approach and effective legislation to overcome it. As Parliament, therefore, you stand at the front of crafting responses to these challenges. The laws and policies you shape must not only address the immediate threats, but also lay the foundation for sustainable security sector governance and reform. RNR Stiftung can support national security sector reform process as well as international interventions. We of course need to understand the overall situation better to be able to assess where we can contribute to improve the situation through legislative means. With the theme, the role of parliament in security sector and governance in West Africa, it is expected that fruitful solutions will be recommended to address insecurity in the region. In Abuja, Muhammad Rabiu Ali, NTN News.